it's one of the best days that there is. New patch day for Civilization 6. About a week ago, I released a poll asking you guys, what Civilization should I play as with the new patch? The voting was super close, so I went down to the comments to see kind of what's really going on. Why is Georgia not an option? Not listed, but Georgia would be cool. Yeah. Yeah, you know, you're right. Maybe I should have put Georgia in the poll. So let's go ahead and see what Georgia's capable of now. I actually don't mind this start. The only problem with this start here, well, we have a couple of nice sources of olives. We have some corn down to the south, wheat to the east, and more corn to the west. Cotton, the only thing I don't like about this start is we actually need to found a religion this game. Because what are we doing? Well, Georgia got a little bit changed, and I've been maybe a little maybe a little bit rough with them in the past. You know, <coughs> so they were worse than ever and stuff like that. Well, they still had their unique walls. But what changed? Well, instead of getting a hundred percent faith bonus per turn after declaring protector at war, they get combat victories provide faith equal to fifty percent of the combat strength of the defeated unit. So for zombies with a combat strength of twenty, they'll always be ten faith. But, you know, it scales up with other, like, warriors. So this would be 10 faith. What I'm thinking of doing is actually, well, let's go for astrology. Maybe we'll find a nice world wonder around here. Should have probably explored. Whoa. Are you kidding me? No way. Okay. okay. Now we found a nice world wonder around here. Oh, man, that's so awesome. Should we do ley lines? I definitely kind of wanted to do voice singers because, you know, the uh, unique monument is so good, but you know this. Let's try this. Do we have anything? Of course, none of them are around us. I was really hoping that would have a ley line close by. Okay, there's one. So we could at least get a nice bonus for our holy site. But oh, there's one. Oh man, that's going to be a tile in the future. Let's go find this scout. Whoa. Well, with Georgia's new buff, the thing I actually like is you could probably get a pretty early, there's another barbarian, pretty early pantheon. Because you, you gotta, well, you gotta kill five scouts, which is a lot. The wicked king pursued Are you kidding me? Wham. Are you kidding me? Did you, <laughs> what is with this new patch? Are we, is this serious right now? Are you serious? And there's an encampment. Okay. Warrior for 95 gold. That's not a bad deal. It's actually something I might take them up on. Hercules. Oh. oh, 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 oh. What? 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 Oh, my. I think I'm broken. I think I'm broken. I think I'm broken. I don't know where to put this. Well, probably right over here. I mean, look at this is a nice camp. This is a nice holy set over here. Surrounded by mountains. This is a nice holy set. This is a nice holy set. Another barbarian encampment over here. Let's go for. Let's go for this one to get our faith. Oh, okay. Let's just go for discipline, and we're gonna go for urban planning. We're gonna try it. We're gonna try to get the pantheon without actually doing any god king stuff. That is what we're going to try for. Okay, there's a warrior. Let's spend 95 gold right here. Boom, got a warrior, and let's go east and take out this this stuff over here. That's how, we're, that's how we're doing it here. Let's think about what we want next. Early Empire would be really good. Let's try to go for Early Empire right away. And one of the best things about this new patch, well, they fixed a few things. If we look here... I'm really, really happy that they increased the melee combat strength of the siege units and added a trebuchet. And why is that? Well, say you're attacking, I don't know, this city. Let's say you're attacking our city, okay? And you usually come from the stuff that's usually hills and stuff like that. So you basically move your catapult when it's range. They obviously have walls because why would you need a catapult? So therefore, they attack you once with the walls and they attack you probably with an archer in there. So it's two archer attacks towards your catapult. So it loses like 60 health and it's down to 40. Then you're like, all right, what do I do with this catapult? Do I attack the city once and then have it die or do I back up? So really to actually siege this city, you need like three catapult units. Unless they're upgraded, then it's definitely much, much better. But I'm hoping the combat strength will help things out. Additionally, especially on Deity, 
catapults by the time I actually got them and then moved them 40 turns to actually get to the city because they're so slow. They were way too weak. So hopefully trebuchets will kind of fill that void. So I think we can fortify and hopefully we live. We should live here. I didn't see the slinger. I am fond of pig. That's not good for business. I thought I would get a promotion too. Okay, now I think that unit's dead. Oh, they're going to attack there. No, don't take our... Okay, good. Please don't die. No! Okay, well, at least we got this one. Go here. Boom, 12 faith. We're almost at enough for our Pantheon. Oh, we could take this one out too. We can, but we'll lose our scout. But now we have 32 faith? Yeah, got our Pantheon. Got our Pantheon. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, were they fast enough for religious settlements? So if we didn't have religious settlements, I would definitely choose God of War for the fun. Because it's so fun. And I'm still really tempted. Like right now, if we choose God of War, we have no Hawaii sites. We have Barbarian coming in to the right. I mean, so that's 20 faith per unit. And then in the late game, it would be kind of nice if we we're actually domination. If we are domination focused, then it would be nice. However, so that's only good kind of, so we're thinking it's only kind of good in the mid to late game. If we get a settler, we can get a city over here and this city will automatically start producing you know, two science return just from this amazing tile. And we'll have all those ley lines and stuff like that. Like, I just think in this case, religious settlements is just like, it's like way, way better for us. For this city location, you know, honestly, right here wouldn't be too bad. We could found it. Yeah, that's a good idea. This game, man, sometimes it's thinking for you, right? If we put it here instead... We can have a nice holy site here and here. Okay, I like this. We'll go holy site here. And then another holy site. Oh, it's already plus four. And then a plus two. So I'm using detail map packs. I talked about this, I don't know, about a month and a half ago or something like that when they first came out. This map, this mod is awesome. It calculates your JC bonus for you. That is so, so nice. Well, what we're going to do over here, we're going to raid this clan. And then we're going to use that money that we took from him for a nice little discount. 95 gold for another another warrior. And the warrior, let's go here. We're going to go inner city and then to the right. <laughs> oh, we didn't get faith for that. Oh, we got some nice yields though. I like that. Let's go ahead and take this one out. Boom. 10 more faith. 17 faith already. Let's go ahead. Holy sight. Yeah, plus two. 80 gold though. We need some gold. We could. Stone Inge is still not done. I'm really confused I am really confused is nobody going for a religion what is going on let's go for a money well that's what we should do we should go for a monument and get Hercules and have Hercules build all of our stuff what am I thinking let's go here get some more faith boom two faith totally worth it watch a good in this game all oh, right this is so much fun playing new patch day look at this okay whatever another hero doesn't matter more faith boom Two more faith. Let's go here. Boom. Found a city. Amazing. Just an amazing city. Ooh, holy sight. Yeah. 50 gold now. Ooh, we don't have enough. Let's go ahead and build a builder here. Yeah. You work some... Work, this three food, two... Three production, two food tile right off the bat. Quite amazing. Man, look at this start. It's so good. That's two awesome. barbarian cam. It's a farm. Two natural wonders. Like, come on. Five faith. That's just so good. So we're in a little bit of a pickle right now. Hercules will be done in two turns. The era ends in eight turns. So you can I can wait eight turns for actually the era to end. Hercules will be even stronger then. However, the primary purpose of Hercules right now is to not actually like take over anything. Is to Hercules is just there to build some holy sites and some amazing ones. So that's why we're building them this early. We are losing a little error score, but that's fine. Let's go ahead, go here. 60 gold. Oh, go do we have enough? Boom, boom. This is what I like to see here. Manage cities. We'll swap this. Let's go ahead and put this holy site down there. And then we'll switch off. We need to build another settler, obviously. And then here, let's go another holy site plus four. Yes. And let's switch off. And let's go for it. Uh trader. You know, maybe another Settler, honestly. Boom. Two more Faith. 
Ooh, let's go over here. Boom, another Holy Saint Fawn done. And more Aeroscore, which you don't really need. And Hercules, you can explore a little bit to the left because I want to see if we can actually find a good city over there. Oh, is that a lake? It's a lake. Oh, so there's a really good Holy City over here. There's a really good city location. There's a lake right there. We can like find out this copper or actually like right here. Oh, oh, oh man. That's going to be a pretty amazing city. Oh, we can get 30 more gold for this. Let's do it. Let's make sure. Oh, wow. 5.72. Yeah. Okay, wait a second here. Let's switch over to Holy Site Prayers. We do not want to actually not get a religion. Six turns for Holy Site Prayers. That would be absolutely bad. Oh, one great prophet's already done. Okay, there are three people going for it. So, yeah, we, I'm still going to do it because we definitely, like, <laughs> the whole point of this game is actually get a religion. Let's see how many we actually get. We are currently at 17, so we will be at 19, but we're finishing up two Holy Separators this turn. 47. Oh, man. That was a lot. 280 faith. If we look here, there's only two AIs going for Great Prophet points, and there's already been two Great Prophets already recruited. So I think we're safe. I think we're safe. Let's just go ahead and build our settlers. Let's go back to our settler building plan. I'm liking that. A Toa? A Toa? 286 for a Toa. Holy smokes, these things are way strong. Oh no, that one's gone. May the forces of e okay, we're definitely following the city over to the east. Or we can do 185 flat gold, which I honestly like better. Yeah, because then we're really, actually, oh, we're really, really close. Like now it'll only be a few turns so we actually get it. And we're going to go for colonization. Because we're going to build some settlers around here. After this, after this trader, we're going to go right for another settler, I think. And Hercules is going to die if we don't back up. I definitely want to back up. I don't want that thing to die. 18 science return is not that much. Oh, we can actually hit with our archer. Oh, you ready for some faith? You ready to see some faith? Boom, 19th faith. That would have been 38 with God of War. Well, not... Exactly, because we're not one of the tiles. But let's go ahead and find a religion. Let me know what you think we should name it. Uh, we'll just go here for now. Let's see what's actually available. I am thinking maybe we should do Jesuit Education. We're, should we actually do Divine Inspiration, Religious Community? What should we actually go for? What should we do for our religion belief? Should we just go for the favorite one? Actually, there it is. The gold one is still there. But let me know in the comments below what we should actually go for for religion. We're also going to buy a Toa in, well, basically next turn. But all right. Thanks for watching this episode.